San Sebastian, and uh, I'm sitting right by the mountain Urugul, which is one of the uh, one of the many mountains around uh, San Sebastian. It's actually right in the center of town, and uh, this is one of the things I really love about this place: is that the nature and the urban areas are together. So you can uh, walk for 10 minutes, go up a mountain and have the feeling that you are away from civilization almost. So uh, we have the sea, we have seen some pictures. There are uh, fishermen. Traditionally, we, uh, we've always gone out to the sea to, to catch fish and uh, we are very much in contact with the sea. Um, swimming a lot and uh, going to the beach a lot also in the winter and then you have the mountains which are so close by you can even walk from town and go out to uh, mountain trips and do trekking for some hours and so there are a lot of mountaineers around and that uh, mountain and sea uh, aspect of San Sebastian is uh, is great so a lot of contact with nature in a very easy spontaneous way that's one of the beautiful things about San Sebastian. One of the things I really like about San Sebastian is that uh, your home expands to the streets. So you can just walk out the door and then there will be life all around. There is always cafes and bars, like local bars where, where you can eat uh, tapas, called pinches in Basque. Um, a little bit of bread with something on top and a glass of wine and, and then you feel at home but away from home uh, by the streets. You can stand up with a glass of wine or sit down with your friends and uh, it's a very um, spontaneous and uh, informal casual way of being together with your friends um, which is really like social life is great in San Sebastian. It's also quite a cultural uh, place. We are around 180,000 uh, people living here and there is quite a, quite a few concerts and uh, cinemas, exhibition centers and contemporary art centers. I think there is a lot of interest in culture too. In that sense I think it's quite a privileged place to be at because you are not far away from many big cities in Spain, uh, also close to Paris, five hours by car, kind of. And uh, the nature is just fantastic. So um, I'm really, really happy living here. The thing about being San Sebastian as an artist is that we are not in a big city like London or Paris or New York. Even though I think for an artist it's really good to have lived in such a place. I, I lived in Barcelona, London and Copenhagen. Um, you also get too much sometimes. It's like a, life is so fast and there are so many things happening all the time. And for me personally I, it was too much at some point. So I had too, too many inputs and I couldn't integrate and digest all the information. So coming to San Sebastian has given me the right amount of input and uh, outlet. I can uh, get inspiration and, and still have the silence and the quietness to, to digest all that information and integrate it and use it as an artist.